Hey you, welcome to some more Sims 3. Uh, we're visiting Leo again. It's been a little while and I figured I should check in on the boys. Now, last time out, um, we had invited, or Leo had invited Quill to come and be a, a roommate. Um, if you remember correctly, and those of you who don't know, Leo had started out living here in this house with his sister. Um, they were cat people who had been cursed inadvertently by their mother and turned into werewolves. So we have cat people who've become smelly old dogs, you know, who complain about shedding and things like that. And then I killed his sister. I didn't mean to, it was an accident, but she only lasted like a day. She didn't, she wasn't around very long. So he was by himself and he was mourning and sad and he was going out and talking to women and then he was crying and, and the man was miserable. So he's starting to get over it, but we invite, you know, invited um, Quill here, Quill, Quill, Quillston of all things, to come and live completely forgetting that Quill is married to Essentia, of course, and we haven't gotten her into the house yet, but we're going to have to do that pretty soon. Now, he wants to go on a date with Rachel, he wants to eat something raw, he wants to become friends with this girl, he who wants to learn or get some rebel influence things going on in his um yeah this guy is like constantly chatting up the girls and the last time I saw him talking to Essentia he was hitting on her dogs don't make for life <laughs> yeah anyway so um for those of you who don't know, Rachel Demon Hand lives next door. She's kind of like the snack cart for a group of a family of um, vampires who live next door. And she was having an affair or a relationship with Kayser here. I didn't know that because she did that all by herself. And Leo here met up with her somewhere and they got a thing going and then they got some stuff going. And as you can see, Kayser's not really friendly with him anymore. <laughs> They're not seeing eye to eye on some things. Now, this rebel thing, I saw it and went, oh, okay, that sounds good. I don't know what it is. So it says, being in a social group is all the rage, but your sin is feeling left out all. Well, he, you know, he's, he's an orphan without siblings. But, what did it say? Your sim... Okay, go out and raise your social influence, but if you're not sure what to do, the smartphone will be your guide. Okay, well, let's go check out what the smartphone's going to tell us. Social groups. Social groups. Okay, the influential nerd activities. So these are what things you do to become part of the nerd group. <laughs> I like it. Use a brain-enhancing machine. I want one of those so bad chat and gossip, talk to them, blah, 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 talk about your gamer skills, oh yeah. There we go, the rebel social group. <clears throat> Herbs eaten? <laughs> I'm not saying a word. <laughs> okay, so he's already got some points in that. He's, uh, So nerd social group game master, unaffiliated. He's just got no like no jock blood at all. <laughs> but apparently he's got a little bit here, and he is a master in the nerd social group. No kidding, because he talks about comic books, pickup lines. Okay, he's done a lot of that. <laughs> well, who knew? That? Okay, and who's this? Who's in here? Lord Harry Davenport is a nerd. Very cool. Quill. There's news. That's probably where he got all his points, was chatting with Quill. And Rachel Demonhand, the chick next door. Oh my god. So, you know, the one he's having the thing with. That's awesome. Social groups. Rebels. Briarstone Quilson. Well, there's a surprise. <laughs> Salvatore Johnson. Okay. Baba Sands. Baba, for shame, for shame. Fred Magnus. 
and Philip Cerule. Well, isn't that just cute? So what, we can call these people and talk to them or we do some of these things? Herbs, successful protest, dumpster dives? Okay, well, we'll see. We'll see about that. But his he wants to, you know, become the leader of a wolf pack. So we have to convert um, apparently four more people. I don't even remember who the first one was. I have no idea. <laughs> Well, goody, goody. I guess we'll find out, right? It's He's not a werewolf, is he? Quill has not become a werewolf. So these are... Uh, that's that's um, a... Uh, what is that? A vampire. <laughs> Wake up. It was a long day. I'm actually so sleepy. I should probably be going to bed. I know the yellow is a witch. I know that's a vampire. I know that's a vampire. She, the light pink one is what? Huh. I don't know what that is for. Of course, it could be a fairy or all kinds of things. Hey, Quill, it's that time of year. So dust off the old costume and come on over. Essentia is throwing a party. Absolutely, absolutely. Thursday, one o'clock in the afternoon. Okay, a little strange, but why not? May as well go. So while he's doing that, I think uh, Leo here should, actually maybe Leo could just crash the party. That could happen. Um, let's head down to the park. Just cause, go here, sweetie. And see who's around and see if we can work on this wolf pack. Oh, look, there's leaves on the ground. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. It's fall. I like it. Apparently it's still warm enough for people to be out playing on the slide here. The leaves are off the trees. Some flowers are still blooming. That's always lovely. Not a lot of people around, though. He may just have to crash that party. Ah, uh, oh, what was he doing, the little ooh thing? I don't know. Who's this? Philippe. Okay, come on, let's go chat to Philippe. I love this, to complain about shedding. It's just like, you know, if I was just meeting a werewolf, I think that would be more information than I needed to know. <laughs> okay, you go attend the party. Okay, Philippe, let's chat. Ask about your career, alma mater. Oh, boasting about gamer skills. That's why he's um, he's so, you know, all nerdly and stuff. That's very cool, because he does that a lot. Uh, is a pizza deliverer. Well, that would always be handy to have in your life, I think. My mouth. Ah, study, talk about dogs, cats, I don't know. Who's this? So, get to know him again. Philippe. Um, da dum 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 Chat. Just have a chat. I'm going to speed this up just a little bit. The werewolf thing, okay, special genius, nerd, charismatic. Ah, <gasps> what do they say about me? I want to know. Oh my god. Werewolf. Joke about shedding? Sure, you know what? Let's see what he's got to sell. Um, or not. <laughs> that didn't go well. Oh my god. Well, okay. We said something wrong. Oh, so this guy just comes on over. All right, Rory. Oh, let's talk to Rory. Rory, would you like to become a werewolf? You know, he's like all rocker dude here and stuff. He might make a great werewolf. I don't, yeah, it might be fun. So get to know. Let's ask him some questions. Find out things about him. Chat. Let's see. Does he like computers? I can't remember what this guy was TV shows, maybe. Get to know. 
And let's speed that up again just a little bit. Go. Go. Uh oh. That's never good. Can we slow it back down? Oh, don't tell me I have crashed this. Wow. I had an uncomfortable moment there. No, no, no. I tell a funny story. It has commitment issues. Oh, yeah. Mr. Rockstar. I remember. So, can we talk about music anywhere? Well, get to know always good because often it pops up some of their traits. Special genius. A few carbs. Quill is the option of breaking a sweat while exercising. Well, I wonder what Quill's been doing. Loves the outdoors. I don't know if Rocker Dude does. I just don't remember. Pick. Oh, give him flowers. Oh, he's really liking this guy. We can compliment his appearance. If he's like a musician, he might like that. Right? <laughs> I want to turn him into a wolf. And then you have to have these people become part of your pack, and, and we'll have to figure out how to do that as we go here, too. Okay, talk faster. I love it with the trees on the ground. That is really, really cool. Ooh, Rory is rich. I don't remember doing that, but I'll take it. I think that's awesome. Special. Oh, no. Joke about shedding. Let's see what happens when you joke about shedding. <laughs> you know what? Being next to this um, fountain is probably not making things any better, is it? <gasps> Look! There's one of the witch sisters. Look, it's a little bitty kitties. Oh my goodness, how cute is that? Look, it's <laughs> So the kittens were like chasing after him. That's kind of awesome. <laughs> oh, look at little kitties, ever cute. Who are these two? Jonesy and Magnus. Cool. And over here we have Adama. That is the father werewolf that sired the family. Um, he's in the washroom. Where's uh? Oh, they were both in the washroom. <gasps> Guys go to the washroom together? I never knew that. We need some light in here at night. I didn't realize it was this dark. That's so good. Although, you know, it's kind of nice too. I thought I had, oh yeah, I've got all these lights. You know what? Just turn them all on. There you go. Light this baby up. Why didn't they come on, I wonder? She's going to play in the little slippy slide there. Okay, where are my boys? Where are you at, Leo? Just follow him into the washroom. That's friendly. <laughs> I had you cornered, dude. I read a bit about gamer skills. Get to know friendly, special werewolf stuff. We're having like a party in the washroom. Very cool. Uh, or something. So these guys are getting to be friends. Commitment, artistic, rich, never hurts. Um, but I'm um, friendly. Celebrity gossip. Ooh, something went wrong. The shedding thing. <laughs> that was the last one I, I put up. Apparently, he didn't think that was funny. <laughs> Animals. Ah, uh, special. Tell him a story. La la la. You get to know one more time. He's getting tired though, right? This will stop going well here soon. Oh, he's athletic. That's always good. Chat. He's hungry. He's tired. Everybody's hungry and tired. So I guess we'll call that enough. Oh, we have a mess in the washroom here. Ew. <laughs> we were partying in a public toilet. These guys are just that good. 
So, Quill has gone to bed. Oh, look, we have horses running through the park. Okay, I'm loving this. Very nice. Wild horses. That makes me happy. I wish I was playing her now so I could haul her over. And, and where did you go? Oh, you're still following him around. Okay, well, that's good. So, talk some more. They're giggling about something. But they're very cute. Outdoors. Uh, get to know. Try that one more time. What have we learned? More. Yeah. Be cool. Maybe this guy's cool. Athletic commitments issues. So we can talk about exercise. Oh, enthused about exercise. There you go. Talk about all the women you're both after. These guys could end up being interesting. Oh, expressive fondness. You should be one of my puppies. Oh, he liked it. That's good. Ah, uh, a friendly hug. Oh, these guys are like all bonding. Complain about the curse. Still can't do anything with that. Yeah, I love the outdoors. Fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ask about your day. How was your day? The exhausting one that I'm not allowed to leave and go home to bed? You mean that one? Gossip. He likes it. Study together. I, you know, I don't see these guys doing it. I think it's time for everybody to just go home here and... Rachel Demon Hand is filthy rich. Oh. And sleeping with all kinds of people. She's just a really friendly lady is all. Okay, well that started out well, not as well now. So I think it's time you went home, Sunshine. You're just, okay, he's just too exhausted. To, he's getting cranky. So the other guy's not finding him as friendly and fun anymore. Nope, nope. And it's winter. My winters are very short. I don't have them set for very long. <laughs> Like a day or two, not too much. Ah, oh, come on, we have something broken. We're not fixing it. I'm just saying. That didn't go so well for me before. Services of a repairman, please. And there we go. We should get a maiden for these guys to, neither one of them actually work for a living, but, um, so who else was in this? We had Briarstone, Salvatore, and Emmeline Sweetgrass, <laughs> and she looks so innocent. Oh my god, she's a rebel. Of course, she's a little old lady that lives with seven men, so, you know, maybe we shouldn't be all that surprised. Down and dirty when they dumpster dive, leave tags or murals on the world, grab a megaphone and rant, pick up lines on available... Maybe we should make her a dog. I don't know. Daring sin, so if we start to dare other people to do things. Speak your heart with an impassioned speech. Telling jokes to other rebels. So we have to track down some of these people and become all rebel -y. Very cool. So Quill had gone off. He's in the hot tub. Quill had gone off to uh, the party, and I guess he's back. We should call Essentia and see if we can't get her to move in. We just ask her to come and move in. There you go. At least she still likes, she had, she's forgiven him apparently for, you know, having left. Just move out, move in with the werewolf. And this is the repair person. You think you could leave him, like, go fix your shower? There you go, your girl's here. Oop, wrong, me. there we go. So friendly. A oh, you're a vegetarian. That's so awesome. She's going to do great in a house full of werewolves. 
Give her a kiss. She's talking to the repairman. That's like Essentia. She's just got to be nice and friendly and make sure everybody feels welcome. Oh, they're having a little date. Compliment her appearance. Confess to watching while you sleep. I don't know. We have to get you moved in here, sweetie. Ooh, there you go. Just get in the hot tub. Hot tub's fun. Ah, uh, stroke your cheek. Oh, they're just making out. They don't even need me. Ask to be a roommate. That's what we need to do. Get her moved in here. Just move on in. She's extremely irresistible. And listen to a compliment. Oh, she's telling him nice things. Wait, where's that? Roommates. They're roommates. Mooch? No. <laughs> okay. Okay, so she moves in, and the first thing he can think of is, can you cook for me or clean up the house? <laughs> okay. Um, I will make sure that I don't mention that to the real essential. <laughs> oh, my God. That's awesome. <laughs> that's good. Can we set it to like the two of them? Because he's in there now. And hopefully she'll be willing to sleep with him because there's not another bed. This is it. You know, he may have been out too long. You never know. Well, let's find out. Um, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Move over here. Back it up. Okay, you get into bed. Sleep in Essentia's bed. I thought I made it his, but whatever. You get in there. Well. Oh, not you. No, get out. Oh my god. That's going to just get me into trouble. Go shower, you kind of smelly there, dude. Okay, sleep in... Leo's bed? No. Set this bed ownership to her. Good. Then this one. Go to sleep. She's a firefighter? I thought she was going to be a roommate. How come I don't have control of her? Maybe it didn't work out. Hmm. Shouldn't she have popped in here? Or maybe that whole roommate thing was, he was just thinking to ask Leo to go clean up. <laughs> oh gosh, boys. Okay, so he's doing that. She's over here. Actually, you should come and join her. Get in. <clears throat> Wake up, dude. You're not that sleepy. Hang holiday lights on the house. Lilith Ann. Oh, well, you're going to have to go to that. Absolutely. Oh, she's skinny dipping. She shoot him out? No, no, no. Okay, you got a moment. Well, we're just going to have I can manually move her in. We can do that. So that'll be fine. Let's go see what he's up to. How's he feeling? Not too bad. Go ice skating on a pond. The party. What time was the party? Not that one. Oh, well, it'll tell me here in a minute. I didn't even notice what time it was. So The boys are eating. They didn't make Essentia come and cook for them. That's nice. Actually, Quill, I believe, wants to improve his cooking skill, as he should. He likes cooking. So, serve dinner of 
Ooh, booby carbonara. That sounds like a quill specialty. Actually, the real quill makes this um, dill, lemon dill, lemon? A dill something. Anyway, it's pasta with dill, and um, it's a little bit sweet, and he puts asparagus and things in it. And it's, it's a recipe he put together himself, and it is the most amazing dish. It's really good. Skate on the pond. Isn't that cute? His cooking skill just went up. That's lovely. And you have got to go to a party. Was at 9.51? Starts in an hour. Okay, go to the party. Let's go follow him. Because that's where the fun stuff's going to happen. <laughs> She's brave, isn't she? She lives like with vampires and she's inviting the um, the werewolf next door that she's sleeping with over. The girls. Oh, look at the Christmas lights or something. Or maybe it was just a glitch. No, it looks like, I don't know what it looks like. It looks like Christmas lights. <laughs> if it's not, it should have been, obviously. So where are you there, sunshine? You hanging around outside? Let's go in. And he's rushing upstairs for what? <clears throat> he's hitting on Ava now. This guy is just like insatiable. And the lady who had the party is in bed? Wake her up. Huh. Well, that's no good. Marin. Lady Jane. Aw, we're all like dressed up. Isn't this pretty? And he's singing for us. Okay, well that was interesting. And I'm just gonna stay and learn to play the piano. Make myself right to home. He's not as good. Not so good. Okay, dude, I think it's time to go home. Get yourself to sleep, although you took a nap earlier. We're gonna have to throw a big old party here. Attend a celebrity party. I think we're going to have to throw our own party here soon. He's met enough people that he should be able to pull off a relatively decent party. And um, we'll get some hot tubbing going and get in the pool and, yeah, see what we can play with here. So, you know, this whole making werewolf thing, I guess you got to be friends. It seems like that you've actually got to uh, connect on some level before you even get the option to... I, and there's potions you can buy somewhere. Um, I'm not organizing. Leo's title with the Rebels is now Line Crosser, so he's losing it. Hmm. Gotta get out there and raise some trouble. I think that could be some fun. So we're gonna do that next time. Uh, and where I'm going to be, I think the next episode, I'm, oh, wait, whoa, 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 what's this? Yeah, she's here, so she stayed, that's very cool. Then you, you can sleep here? Yeah, no problem. Why do they always go to the other person's toilet? I'm not sure why, but there it is. It keeps them happy. So everybody's tucked away resting the night before Christmas kind of thing here and uh, we'll let them do that and my next episode I'm going to be back over on Island Paradise and uh, I've heard we can make resorts so I'm thinking yeah we probably need a resort right so until I see you next time like subscribe leave your comments come back for lots more Sims 3 the Tomb Raider and um, Walking Dead I know are coming to an end and 
I've been missing this game a lot. So lots of Sims 3 coming your way. So until I see you next time, live your life happy and always build it beautiful. Bye-bye.